but the average commute for someone is 24.5 minutes to work. If you're in the business realm, I think it benefits you to uh, keep it within that niche, unless, unless you're like Tim Ferriss and you're interviewing like global experts, then you go as long as you want, because I'll listen to every bit of that, right? But if you don't have Elon Musk on your show, and you, it's good subject, what, what I would recommend is, let's say you interview a subject matter expert, and it went an hour long, you're like, oh, so, such great content, I don't want to cut them off. You're going to cut the episode part one, part two. So then, day one, I listen to part one, then when you release part two, I listen to part two. Why? I've actually talked to people that listen to business podcasts, and they get frustrated when they can't finish an episode, and then they get back in their car and they forgot where they were, because it's very specific. So you want to you wanna kind of bookend it, and if it's you know, 90 minutes, that's three part. And you might release it at the same time, but they're three separate episodes. You want them feeling accomplished, not frustrated that they couldn't finish your episode. Does that make sense? Yes.